Hi you guys, so I'm here with BoxyCharm and Glossy Box, my faves. I actually recorded the, the $10 boxes last month and I'm going to do it now this month, but I just never get a chance to edit and put it up. I don't know how I become so freaking busy. I thought I would have more time, but I don't know. I just don't. Anyway, I'm going to try my best to put up um, a couple of videos. I also have a review on some glasses that I'm going to be doing. Um, I have them there up there somewhere and um, so let me just get right into it okay we're gonna do boxycharm first because boxycharm is like really banged up and uh, misshapen but let's see here we have the card which says beach please Ooh, <laughs> I already know what that says whatever okay Okay, so inside, it's kind of bulky, I guess, because of this foam, which is nice to keep things from getting all damaged inside. So here is everything on the inside. We got something really nice from Tarte. I did take a quick peek. I haven't opened anything, but I just kind of opened the box and looked at it. So it's an estimation about $106. However, this Rainforest of the Sea Volume 2 um, palette that's going to be in here, it's retailed here for 36 but right now it's like on sale for like uh i want to say 18 dollars or something like that on ulta or sephora's website i think it's sephora move the camera just a tad bit to kind of avoid back there all the boxes and junk back there anyway so speaking of that one i'm going to open this one first so the Rainforest of the Sea Volume 2. I looked at what it was supposed to be online. I didn't open this box yet. Um, the number three is the really nice one. It's really pretty packaging. It's uh, ocean-like, I guess you can say. So when you open it, it's, it's really pretty. A lot of neutral tones, um, but kind of, I don't know. I look at it and I kind of think, meh, it's just, Kind of meh, I don't know. A really nice size mirror that's right there, which is really nice. Um, I almost don't want to touch it and swatch it because I'm thinking I might just do like add this in a giveaway or something because I have a feeling I'm not gonna use it. I don't know, I'll debate it. We'll see. Next are some lashes from Pure. They're Pro Eyelashes 3T 3D Cure Cure I cannot speak. 3D Cruelty Free Lux Lashes. There you go. All right, up to 30 wears. I don't know. I don't wear lashes, so I always wanted to, but I just don't. These are so pretty, though. Like they're like very flirty and real pretty looking. I also got um I got a. A Vox box, the Bare Minerals Vox box. It's the Bare Pro foundation, which I'm wearing today. I normally mix all my foundations, always, 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 because that's just how I am. And this one I'm wearing alone. And then I, this morning I walked by the mirror and I was like, oh crap, I look very pale. So I started putting, I put bronzer all over. I went out, I was out all day. I go and I look in my mirror in the car on my way home from being out all day. And I was like, why didn't anybody tell me I look like this? I had put so much bronzer, it was just like orange, orange on the sides of my face. And I was like, can anybody be nice and say, too much, too much. So I was in the car trying to fix it. How embarrassing. Did it ever happen to you guys? A little bit too much. Okay, and then we have from Moda Pro some um, brushes here. There's three brushes. They have a pointy brush. Um, to apply blush and powder with precision or use a tapered edge to create a subtle contour. The chisel brush um, to apply highlighter or contour and then the crease to define and blend the crease or use to buff over your entire lid. Ooh, these have a very, very cool rubbery um, handle. That's so cool. I wish I would have gotten different brushes but that's okay. I like these cool handles. These are awesome. So these are very nice brushes. I love, they're not, I thought they were kind of rubberized, but they're not. They just look like they're rubberized, but it's got like a matte texture to it. They're very cool, very cool brushes. 
Okay, next we have from Bella Pierre. This is a gel eyeliner in ebony. I'm not going to open it because I just don't want to open this one right now in case I want to use it later. And it's a gel liner, so I do like gel liners because they go on really, really nice. And then we have from hashtag girl power, matte liquid lipstick from the beauty crop. This one is in Dale Nights. Let's see. A girlfriend of mine got her box and she told me that she didn't really like her lip color too much. I can't remember which one she said she got, what shade, but I just have like a very light, um, neutral pink kind of tone on. Let me see. Let me use my little mirror here that I got from Tarte. Okay. So that's a pretty color. I kind of like the the light color I had on for the day today. Um, but this is pretty. I don't think I would wear it to work or anything because it's a little bit, ah, it's getting on my teeth. It's a little bit too dark for my taste to wear to work, but I'm gonna take some of this off. It's not bad, it's pretty. Actually, let me just leave it on, see how it dries down. Because uh, she was like, she did not like the way that it, it wore. So overall, a very nice box. Oh, and there's a little $10 off 60 from Tarte here. Boxy August from, okay, that's the code Boxy August. So overall, pretty nice box. We have the lashes, we have the lippy, the brushes, the liners in here. And then the um, for someone, I think for anyone that doesn't really have um, a big collection of things. This is a fantastic box for me. I mean, they're great items. Don't get me wrong. I'm just kind of like, oh, okay. It, it's nice. Now nah, it's nice. It's very nice. But anyway, let's okay. Move inside on. glossy box. It feels kind of light. It says, "Stay cool." I don't know if you can see that there. Oh yeah, that's right. They said um, like if you reviewed the blush last month, you would get another blush to go into that palette from the Dolce, Douche, whatever the heck it was called. Um, this one is in Pink Beach. It's very sticky. Like I'm I'm talking, but it's it's like throwing me off about the stickiness. Plane is flying overhead. Sorry, into the clouds. Okay, so this is a pretty pink blush. They have like very unique packaging. Um, this one is magnetized to go into the blush palette that we got last month. And then this little plastic thing just slides right open. Then we have from Dr. Babor. Is that how you say it? Babor? Babor? Hydro RX 3D Hydro Eye Gel Pads. So it's just one set of pads. And then we have from Aroma Floria Aromatherapy for Feet's Sake. Intense Repair Spa Foot Butter with Shea Butter, Vitamin E, Tea Tree, and Mint. Oh, it has a seal on it, so I'm not going to open that just yet. And then from Pixie by Petra, we have a clear brow gel, which that's always nice to have. I like having them. I actually hope that this kind of like keeps them like for real stay in place because I like them when they're almost crunchy because my brows are so untamed and if they don't stay crunchy then they just kind of fall so I need something to like like hairspray and a little wand that's what I need then we have from Lancome Monsieur Big Mascara all of Lancome's mascaras to me I love them so this one oh this one looks it almost looks like a, a little lipstick Ooh. It's a nice wand. I like this kind of wand. It's evenly large all the way from tip to end or end to tip, whatever you want to call it. And last thing in this box is from Bliss Grapefruit and Aloe Body Butter um, Maximum Moisture. So it's a nice box. It's, 
it's just an okay box. So we have this, we have the mascara, we have um, the eye patches, the foots, what is this? Repair cream kind of thing, the eyebrow stuff, and then we have the blush. So very nice. One, two, three, four, five, six. So overall, nice boxes. This lip color, look. It's one of those sticky matte lipsticks, which I don't like. It's, just, it's not my thing. Don't like it. Um, it doesn't look bad. It's not transfer proof because it's right there on my hand. Um, I don't like that stickiness at all. It's not my thing. Some people are okay with that. I know you could like probably put some powder over and stuff like that. I'm just, that's just uh, too much work for me. I want it to dry and be done with it. I don't want to have to mess with it. So anyway, those are my boxes. Not too bad. They're both okay this month. Um, that's it, you guys. Thank you so very much for watching and joining me for my Battle of the Boxes with BoxyCharm and Glossy Box. And I will see you again in another video. Bye.